In this short module, we would look at another interesting activity. If you are customer of an Islamic bank or customer of another conventional bank, you might have seen a lot of advertisements in the bank branches or elsewhere whereby the banks would be offering prizes to their customers. In some cases, this would be if you open an account with us, we would be putting you in a draw with the possibility for you to win a car. In certain cases, these prizes could be in the form of tickets. If you are our customer, if you open an account during this time period, or if you keep your money in this account for certain time period, you would enter into a draw and you might be able to go for Umrah if you are a winner. So these are the examples of prizes in banking and quite a number of Islamic banks, they are offering these prizes as well. So the question arises, is it Sharia compliant to do so? Not always. There are certain products on which Islamic banks cannot issue or offer prizes. The most obvious one is a current account. Islamic banks offer current accounts. In current accounts, what happens? The depositors, they deposit their money, which could be deemed as a loan to the bank. It is an interest-free loan because current accounts don't give you any interest. Now, if an Islamic bank offers prizes to the current account holders, this is not permissible because these prizes would be deemed as a benefit to the lender. In case of riba or in case of prohibition of riba, we know that any benefit going to the lender directly or indirectly would be deemed as prohibited interest. So, if a depositor has an arrangement with an Islamic bank which is equivalent to a lender borrower arrangement, then the bank would not be able to offer prizes on that product. However, there are other products on which prizes can be issued without any major restriction. And I'm using the word any major restrictions, although in certain cases there would be some minor restrictions. For example, we have uh, been looking into profit sharing investment accounts. Profit sharing investment accounts are investment based products. On investment based products, it is permissible for the for an Islamic bank to offer prizes to its profit sharing investment accounts. Through a draw or without a draw using another random mechanism. I must also clarify that draw itself is not haram. So, if I am tossing a coin right now, my this activity is not deemed as haram. This would become haram only when this is associated with a prohibited activity. For example, if tossing a coin is associated with gambling, then of course this type of draw would be deemed as prohibited. If Pakistan's cricket team's captain goes out in the field and tosses a coin, that is not haram. Although I have quite a few friends 
who would say that even this one is haram but that's not true 